My name is Simon Elliott and I'm a quantum chemist. Quantum chemistry is a branch of science that looks at how the structure and reactivity of molecules and materials takes place. And it's a very useful science because chemical reactions are all around us. Uh, the chemical reactions are the basis of all living things, for example. So, take a deep breath. When you breathe in, the oxygen from the air comes into your lungs and binds with iron, iron in the haemoglobin molecules in your red blood cells. And the oxygen and the iron react together and the oxygen is brought through this blood all the way around your body. And quantum chemistry can explain the first step, how the oxygen and the iron bind together in your lungs. And of course there are lots of other chemical reactions that quantum chemistry can help with. When you're doing the washing up, with soapy water, baking a cake, brewing beer, um, smelting steel or, or making plastic cups in a factory. All these things are chemical reactions and we need to know how the atoms bind together and how a chemical reaction takes place. So it's the electrons that bind atoms together and electrons are like the glue. What we want to do is explain the glue that, that is between atoms when a chemical reaction takes place. So for that we use quantum mechanics. And quantum mechanics you may have heard of, it's a very strange set of phenomena that Things happen at the quantum scale in a different way to what we're used to in everyday life. So apparently at the quantum scale, things can be in two places at once. Or electron, electrons at the quantum scale have a funny sort of quantum spin, even though they're not actually rotating in space at all. But as a quantum chemist, I'm working with this every day, and you do sort of get used to all the different quantum phenomena. So the electrons that we're looking at, we don't think of them as little balls, we think of them more as globs of jelly, that can appear and disappear and do the sticking together between the atoms. So for example, when the iron and the oxygen bind together in your lungs, we can find out what's happening through quantum chemistry. We can see that the electrons from the iron move over onto the oxygen and envelop it, and the spins on the iron and the oxygen kind of line up and start to cancel out, and the electrons move more slowly and that makes it more stable. And the haemoglobin molecule opens up and it's able to carry the oxygen all around the body. So that's what I really love about quantum chemistry. It's able to give you a really detailed understanding of chemical reactions. Chemical reactions that are all around us, in the kitchen or in the lab or in our bodies. Every breath that we take.